Hey what's up everybody welcome to Adam's Toy Library and today I'm going to show you two different books uh, from Marvel Comics. One is a small paperback called Origin of Marvel Comics and another one is the official handbook of Marvel Universe. Now the reason behind this review having two different kind of books in one single review is that these two books are essentially uh, character guides of Marvel Comics. Uh, one is a small paperback, another one is a hard bind. So without wasting time, let's jump into the video and see what's inside these books. So the first book is The Origin of Marvel Comics. Uh, you can see uh, some Marvel characters, very important Marvel characters like the Avengers and some of the Marvel Knights are also there, a few X-Men and all four members of Fantastic Four are there in the cover page. The side says origin of Marvel Comics from Marvel and a small photograph of Wolverine. If I turn it back, there are some X-Men and a price tag is also there, says 1624 rupees in India. So this book consists of uh, the file cards of entire Marvel Universe characters. Uh, there are many missing characters. We can understand that uh, a single book cannot cover entire Marvel Universe character details. But uh, this book covered a lot of characters inside it. So these are the first few pages. We can see Captain America's origin details Doctor Doom Amazing Spider-Man and Green Goblin Mighty Thor and Loki The Avengers and X-Men all wrapped up in one page Daredevil, Doctor Strange Black Panther, Nick Fury and S.H.I.E.L.D. Wolverine, Hawkeye, Mockingbird, Black Widow, Punisher, Black Cat, Miss Marvel and Hercules, Luke Cage, Iron Fist, Moon Knight and Ares, Spider Woman, Ghost Rider, Scar, the Son of Hulk, and the Pet Avengers, then there are some details of Power Pack, The Hood, Sentry, finishing with Captain America, uh, the modern Captain America or Bucky Cap. The next part is the origins of Marvel Comics X-Men. So Professor X, Magneto, two of the most important characters, Cyclops, Iceman, Archangel, Beast, Phoenix, Havoc, Wolverine, Storm, Rogue, Colossus, Kitty Pride, Psylocke, Cannonball, Magic, Karma, Cable, Domino, Deadpool, Gambit, Jubilee, Emma Frost, Northstar, Maddox, Pixie, Phantom X, Armor, Danger, X-23, Dakin, Neymar, some details about the X-Club and Hope Summers. Then the main part comes in this book, says the Heroic Age Superheroes. 
and heroic age villains interestingly Deadpool is here in the villains list so these are the creators of the book and the main part begins with the details of the heroic heroic age superheroes and all the superheroes starting from A to Z alphabetically are present in this book as file cards so this is the main highlight of this book now if I pick one of them you can see beta ray bill with a file card design their affiliations the status uh, some details about beta ray bill some pros and cons and the power grid this is a very important thing now out of 1 to 10 how much this superhero can be rated in terms of power conscience altruism wisdom courage determination free will and vulnerability so these parameters are checked in every single file card and there are thousands of characters thousands of file card so such an unique kind of book this is where not only superheroes have been shown but sometimes there are some groups like inhuman has been shown all together lots and lots of pages filled with details and know-how about your favorite superheroes whenever you get a chance to roam around the Marvel Universe whenever you see a new character you can get his or her reference here and know something about them now again I say as I said that these books are not filled with all the details but you can get some idea about these characters so after superheroes there are su super villains I'm not going uh, by every character's details page by page or file card by file card so it will take a long time but this is just a brief idea how this books this book looks it is essentially made up of all the file cards so great to have such book in your collection if you are a Marvel fan after the superheroes and supervillains let's indulge ourselves into the X-Men world some details and then the file cards begin almost all important X-Men covered in this book very strategically placed details are there in this book and really thankful to all the creators of this book to give us the Marvel Universe fans such unique and excellent thing to read and collect so this is all about this book uh, let's move into the next so as a collector if you don't like paperbacks you can go for the hard bind hardcover books like this it says Marvel Omnibus the official handbook of Marvel Universe with a human torch photo in the side 
in the front again some important Marvel characters fighting each other says the Marvel Universe official handbook and the back says collecting official handbook of Marvel Universe 1983 1 to 15 so issue number 1 to 15 all covered in a single hard bind book it says from abomination to Zax I mean A to Z almost every character is here again what I love in this book is the uniformity there are a lot of uh, character guides and encyclopedia available for Marvel Universe in the market but this book caught my eyes because of the uniformity and the artwork present in the book so I removed the slip cover present over the book and this is how it looks the actual hard bind says the official handbook of Marvel Universe with some of the Marvel characters and these are the creators if you want to read pause the video have a look and go ahead so this is the content nothing exaggerated or extravagantly mentioned here all the details of different characters alphabetically placed here from abomination to Zax and book says it is near about 440 pages so this is the first issue I think the issue number one for official handbook of Marvel Universe and it says from abomination to Avengers Quinjet and all the contents of that particular issue so this is abomination absorbing man and some of the other characters one thing very special about this book is the artwork it reminds me the artwork of 80s absolutely incredible artwork from that particular era So as I mentioned earlier, there are a lot of uh, other character guides present in the market, but the artwork in this book is phenomenal. The details, you may find these details in Google and in any other Marvel character guide books, but uh, as a collector, uh, I really like this book. To have in my collection because of its uniformity the full structure uh, picture from head to toe of a character is given here with a single page details of all so really uniform really balanced and fantastic to look and read it is not a boring kind of data filled book so you will get a glance of a character you don't know and you want to know that how he or she looks what are the superpowers or ability uh, you won't miss a single thing here so it's difficult to go one by one and show you every page it will be a spoiler also for those who haven't the book yet in their collection so I'm not going to show you all the pages but some important characters like Iron Feast and Iron Man they all have maximum a single page about themselves not more than that so that makes the book special that briefs everything so as I said all the issues from issue 1 to 15 this is another issue says from Mandarin to Mystique 
and the date where sorry when it first published At last, uh, you will see the Book of Weapons, Hardware and Paraphernalia of Marvel Universe, like Ant-Man's Helmet. What is the anatomy? What are the special features? Which part works in which way? The Blacklash Whip, Book of Vishanti. Captain America's shield and motorcycle, the dark hold, Deathlock's gun, Cyclops visor, every details is neatly given there with the flavor of 80s artwork. Absolutely incredible. You have to have this book in your collection if you are a Marvel fan. The stilt man's battle suit and some other details year by year. Some of the story backstory behind this book. artwork at the end and some of the artworks and the artists of this book so this is it hope you really like this video and if you like the video please hit a like subscribe to my channel don't forget to mention your views in the comment box so that I can improve my channel content give you new and new comic book action figure and other collectibles review so that's it friend that's it from my side have a great day see you soon